Hey guys, so I have a face mask video to do for you today, and my hair is a little bit wet in the front because I just filmed the footage for this. I was uh, doing the face mask and then realized, like an idiot, I left the uh, the washing machine going, which is on the other side of the the bathroom wall. So I'm gonna just uh, insert the clip of me doing the mask and then be talking about it. So. This is the Pharmacy Honey Potion Renewing Antioxidant Hydration Mask. Now, I was sent this to review, so get that disclaimer out of the way. I love this brand. They have sent me stuff in the past to review. I had their face wash, which I still have, um, a mask, the lip balm, which is like amazing. Um, this is the Lemon Citrus citrus lemongrass one, which I've used quite a bit of. This is like my favorite lip balm ever. Um, and I had a moisturizer, a, a couple other things, but to get into this, this is the honey mask, uh, honey potion. And the packaging on this is so cool because it comes with a little spatula to spread it on your face and it's magnetized so that you can just stick it to the cap and not lose it. That is genius. I don't know why other companies don't do that, but that's a really go good idea. Now, my phone is ringing. Let's show you. It comes, it has this little, uh, like, pull tab thing, which I've been leaving in here just so that I don't get the lid all sticky. But it does look and feel like honey, and it has a very faint honey scent. But other than that, it really doesn't have a scent to it. Um, this stuff is really nice. I know it retails for $56, I think, but their stuff is so worth it because everything is like plant-based and supernatural. And so I'm going to show you real quick. You're going to see it in the clip that I put in here. It feels sticky at first, but once you apply it, like you put it on your face with the spatula and then you work it into your skin, it turns white, and then it's not super sticky anymore, it's just like a cream, and you're gonna feel it warming, because it's a warming mask, it starts getting warm as soon as you start rubbing it in like that, um, <clears throat> so it doesn't, um, I to get my thoughts together here, so you put put it on your face with the spatula, you work it in until it's all like a white creamy face mask, then you gotta leave it on for about 10 minutes, I, I leave it on for 10 minutes, I've used it a few times already. Um, it does heat up but it doesn't get like super hot or anything. Now the one thing I will say, if you have sensitive skin, and this is the, the, ish, the mistake I made the first time I used this, do not take it off with hot water because something about when the hot water hits the mask it burns. I don't know what is in it <clears throat> that makes it do that but it was burning and then my cheeks were all red the next day but <laughs> I gave it a few more goes and I realized when you take it off with cool water it's perfectly fine and this mask just leaves your skin so soft and like glowing. I have nothing on my <clears throat> I'm losing my voice. I have nothing on my face uh, for face makeup right now. I have I have lipstick and I have eyeshadow, but nothing on my face for foundation or in primer, nothing, because I just filmed the footage for this, but it's just, I can't recommend it enough. It's a really nice face mask. If you look on, um, they sell this on their website, obviously, pharmacybeauty.com, but they also sell pharmacy products at Sephora, and all the reviews for this on sephora.com are awesome so pharmacy if you haven't given the, any of their products a try yet they're so worth it like try one of their face their sheet masks or something just to start off and then you will see how amazing they are but i'm not just saying that because they sent this to me it, it's really something that i would actually buy because their products are so awesome so this is the honey potion mask you get 4.1 ounces it does come in a nice this is glass i believe it's nice and heavy and i love that this is magnetized so i won't lose it because i tend to lose a lot of things in the bathroom um 
But yeah, I'm trying to find the box that came with it and... Oh, here it is. My son loves this box for some reason, but <laughs> they always have really cool packaging, like box-wise. So it's got like a honeycomb on the outside and then it unfolds like this and has all the info in here and then this is what the actual product was in. So it tells you the story of Pharmacy Beauty. Um, meet the farmers, experience the sci science, just get that stuff in there. But yeah, I think I'm going to keep keep the box because it's really cool looking. I know the last thing I got from them was neat looking too. Oh yeah, they, uh, the facial mist was the last thing I got from them and it had a cool fold out box like this too. So, I can get that back in there, put this away, okay. Aiden will probably play with that. <laughs> but really nice. If you like warming face masks especially, you're going to love this one. Let me put this thing back in here. It seems like it's going to last for a while because I only use like a dab of it every time I... It says to put a thick layer on, but honestly you don't need that much because it's a thick product anyway. Really like it so far, so give it a try if you... Are intrigued by this. I always love trying new skincare products, especially when it's from a brand that I already know I like. So, hope you guys enjoyed my little review. I will have a blog post to go along with this as well on my blog, so check that out if you want to see more pictures, and I will talk to you guys in my next video.